Hi there everyone, um, and welcome back to the channel. Um, unfortunately I haven't been posting in a while, um, and that's because I opened a backup account. If this account gets deleted or whatever, I'll have a backup account. But, I have another account open that I started posting, and I totally forgot about this account. So, I'm gonna be giving you guys a life update. And I also will be posting two more videos um, this week. One will be, um, um, it'll be kind of a surprise. And the other one will be talking about what I got for Christmas and what I got my family for Christmas. So now let's start with the life up update, technically. So as I said, I opened a new account and let's just get on to it. That account is basically for anything I do with art. This account is the same thing, but I do a whole bunch of DIYs, and I talk a lot more on this one. Um, um, so, like, I would say I would, um, DIY paint, um, one of the walls in my room. That's where I would post in this account. And the other one, the other one, I'll just show a little bit of an update and what I did. But besides that, I wouldn't do anything. So, um, I would say the last time I posted was about, um, November or so. So, let's go backtrack to November. So, November, um, I was doing school. I switched schools. Um, as some of you guys may know, I had an issue. Um, I will explain that in this video, but I won't share all the details. I got in trouble for sending a message to my friend, and somehow that old f that friend of mine, which she is no longer my friend, as you may say. In this video, I will be calling her, not by her name, but um, by someone else's name. So, I don't give out any information like that. I'll call her Elizabeth in this video. So, Elizabeth and I have been friends for, I would say, three years. And we weren't really talking, so I wanted to take a break. And then I thought, why don't we just um, separate and not be friends anymore? So, I text her, hey, Elizabeth, I'm sorry to say this on such like, short notice, but... We haven't been talking a lot, so I think we should take a break on being friends, and in the future, if I would like, we can go back to being friends. Now, this issue escalated very bigly, and it almost got me suspended from that old school of mine, which that school I had so many issues in. Um, so Isabel and I, and then she wasn't taking it so lightly, um, she said a whole bunch of curse words, which I'm not going to say, but she said a lot of things, and, um, I also had to reply to that because I did not feel like that was necessary, and mind you guys, this was in August, so, um, this started before I started, um, the school year on that school. Now, the school, I'm just going to say it's a charter school. That's all I'm going to say. And this charter school, I've already been written up, I would say, once or twice. One was because I had a list of my friends, and that was absolutely crazy. Because I just had a list of people that were in my life. And they were just random numbers, 1 to 10. And a whole bunch of kids in my class's name, and a whole bunch of other kids that are from other classes. And they went ahead and called my parents for that, which was absolutely stupid because all I did was have people's names on it and um, some people from my old school that I had names on. Now, as a joke, I put enemies on the very top of the list, which was a joke. I told them it was a joke. It's not real. I did not want to kill anyone, which they thought. Whenever you do something like that, they think you're going to kill someone. Which I told them, they're old friends. And if they're on that list, that means they're brand new friends. And it was just a joke. But they took it serious. 
and they suspended me for the rest of the day that day. And, um, there was a school dance that day, so I went to the dance. I apologized to everyone that was on the list because they made me do it. And there was someone with me while I was apologizing to everyone, which was absolutely crazy because everyone knew about it. And, um, let's just get on to it. So, I had to reply to what my, um, what Elizabeth said, as I am saying her. Not her real name, but just a random name. Um, so, I would say a couple, like, not a couple months, but a month later, the school went ahead and emailed my mother. Now, mind you guys, this message I sent, um, the beginning of August. Um, actually, I would say towards my birthday in August, or towards my brother's birthday, and that's a week apart. I would say the tw- the 17th to the 20th, per-, per se. And mind you guys, I had to do counseling. And since this um situa- situation escalated, and I told them then and there. I don't know why this issue is like this. Because I sent this message during summer break. And I told them, it's not like I'm going to be in this school for long. Because I'm transferring schools. I told them then and there. Um, there is nothing that I did wrong besides call her this and this names. And as well, she also called me a whole bunch of names. When I tried apologizing, again, she said a whole bunch of names. I told them that and they still did not believe me. Once I started doing the counseling, it wasn't better. It was just a waste of time. A waste of my time, which I should have been doing homework at the time. And I wouldn't get, I would be done with school at 1.30. I would then take a break from 1.30 to 2 o'clock. That's a 30 minute break. Now, once I started counseling, I got the 30 minute break. But then I had to be on with the counselor from 2 o'clock to 2.30. Sometimes it would be from 2 to 3 o'clock. And this counseling lady was absolutely ridiculous and annoying. But finally, once I told her, I'm sorry, um, this is my last time I'll be meeting with you because this is my lack my last week at this charter at this in this charter school. And um that's how I almost got suspended for sending a message to my friend. Um so then came I went to another charter school. Well, not technically a charter school. It's a public charter school, which technically you can say it's another charter school. It's um a few blocks away from the other charter school. They are right near each other. And um it was just um better. Now that I started this, I have absolutely no friends. I do not know anyone besides the teachers. Some of these teachers don't even know me. Um, My math teacher and another teacher that I have, they absolutely adore me because I get A's in their classes. Some other classes, I don't have the brightest grades, but that's that's being changed. That's that I fell a little bit behind. Um... But now that this is being posted the 30th, the very last day of 2021, this is when this video will be posted. Um, um, I will say that, um, this year has been absolutely exhausting, especially the first couple months of 2020 when I started dating this random guy in, um, the charter school. Now, even though now I feel like um, it was a good decision to break up with him and a bad decision at the same time. I'm going to explain that. The bad part about it was I was losing someone I was talking to in life. And that was there whenever I needed to speak to someone. Now, I have tried many times to get in contact again with this guy. But unfortunately, he would not message me back. Because, mind you guys, at the beginning of 2020 he had a phone he had instagram everything 
now all he has is um, a computer that he uses for school. And that is it. His mother doesn't even have a phone. And I tried texting her number as well. Calling her as well. Um, to see if he would answer. But no. I just recently found out when she answered. That it was her phone. And not his. And um, he was in that charter school with Elizabeth as you may see. And, um, so the good news about it was he was a pervert. I don't want to say this too loud because I do have other people in my house. Um, he was a pervert. Um, he begged me and begged me for nudes, as you may say. And that absolutely creeped me out. Unfortunately, I was forced into doing that. And... Um, I found out once we broke up, because I claimed I cheated on him, which I kind of did. I was texting another guy, and he wanted to start dating, but I told him, give me a week or so to break up with this and this such guy, because we are not really in a good place. So, um, that's when Elizabeth and I was were friends. Um, and me and her had came up with a plan. She wanted to date him, and so did another girl that I knew. They both wanted to date him. Unfortunately, I told them, you guys can't. I was dating him at the time. But then, after all, I told them, go ahead, you guys can date him. I don't care anymore because he did not treat me well and this and that. Now, Elizabeth didn't want to date him, date him. She just wanted to get him off my tracks, which I absolutely thank her for that. Um, because that guy was crazy. Now, I did reject him when he wanted, um, to date me again. Which, I do regret, and don't regret at the same time. Because, again, I will say it, he always wanted this and this thing for me. He always wanted me to do this and that for him. And I already told him, I'm sorry, but I don't want to do this and this such for you. So now moving on from this, I have a new school and everything, as I said. Um, and I guess that would um, completely say this. Um, I cannot get in touch with this kid anymore. I tried using an old an old account of mine the school blocked me from using it one well, didn't block me they just changed the password well i changed the password so they wouldn't hack the account or anything and i'm gonna try again to get in contact with this and this person and i do know how to email me now um I'm going to walk away and I'm going to go grab my computer, which will be right over there. And I won't be editing this out of the video because I am going to continue on speaking. Um, now, as I told you guys again, um, he is still going to that school. Hopefully he replied because a couple months ago I did message him. And, um, if not, I'm just going to, to try to message him again. And, um, this is a new computer I have for the school I'm going to now. So, let me open this up. And, um, um, I messaged him to Google Hangouts. So, I'm going to open Hangouts. And Gmail. And if he doesn't answer through this, um, what I will do is I will go get um, my phone, which is off to the side over there. And I will log into my old account and see if he replies. Now, I do have his email. I do have
so I have his account, um, unfortunately, I do not think that this is, um, appropriate for me, but, um, again, I will say this, um, this was just to get back in contact with him if he wants to be in contact with me. Um, I'm not going to be saying my name, um, or his name. Let's call him Joshua, actually. Let's call him John. So, I, um, messaged John through his old, his account for school. And I said, hey babe, remember me? Now, this was just to get him to try to figure out who it was. Um, if you do remember me, please reply to my hangout invitation and this email. Please contact me. I miss you. I miss you as friends. Um, and I said, from yours truly, Sam. And I said, Sam is a code for something only you and me know. Now, I will keep this open and I'm going to go grab my phone now. Because, um, actually, I think I would like to make a part two on this video, which I will record and post by, I would say, next week, Monday. Um, unfortunately, sometimes this stuff gets me absolutely nervous, and I just tend to start shaking and freak out and think my parents are going to ground me and take my, all my devices for this. But if you think about it, all my devices and electronics are my camera, my TV, my heat press, my Cricut, my computer, and my phone. Now, they cannot take away my computer because I do need that for school. And they can't take away the TV because the TV, the TV is glued to, it's stuck to the wall. Now, they can't take away my phone, which, um, it's kind of scary. But, um, also in the next video, I will be showing you guys something. Um, I will be texting his old number. Um, and sorry for my whisper. Um, until then, um, I'll be posting this video, and I'll see you guys in my next one. And, again, as I said this, if you guys are new here, like, subscribe, comment, and comment what other type of videos you want me to do. Bye!